My name is John Magalay. Um, I'm originally from the New Lodge Road. I've been up in the old park working since 1981, a uh, long time. And uh, our, it's a family business, we'll have, which is on, a, on a, an interface here between the two communities. I've been to residentials with people who live down the street here. Uh, one man in particular, I used to see him every day for a lifetime, who lives just, oh, just below the interface. I met him on a residential a couple of years back and when I introduced myself to him, he asked who I was and he says, well, I can actually see you from where I work on the old park road to where your house is in the Protestant community. I see you every morning stand at your door having a smoke. And he couldn't believe this and I'm only up the street from him. Just sort of reflected on how much things have changed over the years. It's, it's unbelievable the work that has been done to bring it around to what it is now. The reason why I feel that the, the, the district is a better place now, especially on interface, is due to the work that has been done between both communities, involving uh, the Morrow Bone Group and also CCRF and also NBIN. They also have, have played a big role on bringing sort of the piece, the, the interfaces to what they are today. Going back, 10 years ago, maybe not even as far as 10 years ago, we could have had, we could be guaranteed a, a full scale rat on this road here on the 11th of July every year and other weekends throughout the year, especially summer nights. Um, you know, so it definitely is a far better place and at the minute too there's been a massive amount of work uh, put into the Bone Hills up here which became a bit of a hot spot there for a while and the elected reps um, have been all over it, doing a lot of real work, doing intervention work as well. So it's, it's, it's definitely a change place from whenever I first came up here. I mean, it's important that one community group interacts with other communities as well because of obviously learning and picking up on different things. And it also gives the kids who are involved with the, the community groups here a chance to be to interact in other communities rather than be just sort of confined to the one area. It's, it's, it's broadening their horizon and it's, it's empowering them to, to do more outside their own community, you know. Marlborough is an area actually is, is, a, is a pretty nice place to be in. There's no question about it. Good people, very um, very very parochial people, and very very solid. You know, a lot of great characters around here, and a lot of great amenities for people as well. You know, so they don't have to travel far for what they need, which is very important too. I'll talk forever. <laughs> <laughs>